ourselves to be coached. We really uh, hold each other accountable. And it makes all the difference. Would that be a recruiting factor for you making that decision again this summer? Yeah, we'll <laughs> You talked about guys all processing this differently. Folks from the late process, what's going through your mind? Yeah, see, I'm a competitor. So, uh, for me, it's just about winning. You want to win. You want to you know, do something. You know, most of your life, uh, you just want to feel what it you know, you know, feel what it feels like to win and be on top. And, uh, you know, that's all it's about with this group. These guys just want to win. These guys want to want to enjoy one another, but they ultimately want to win. They're on top. David, quick question to all the people that are watching in Turkey that stayed up uh, yeah. two years in a row that are watching. I oh, don't know. Second question: If you like Swaggy TV, Swaggy Champ. Right, that'll work. <laughs> that'll work. Swaggy Champ's got a nice ring to it. Yeah. To all the people that are watching you guys in Turkey live now, any messages? Congratulations, by the way. Yeah, we just yeah, basketball's a global game. Enjoy it. Hey Dave, I'm awesome. Yeah, like that so tough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we uh, we just worked. I mean, we had different guys throughout the year. We carried the lead. We dealt with some, some things internally. Uh, you guys know that about that shit. That was true. That was true. Some stuff. Yeah. That was true. And uh, it's a testament to the level, the type of people these guys are, how tied together you know we were as a group, committed we were to, to winning. Yeah. You consider Steph was playing Cook during the JD, Patrick McCall getting hurt. Mm -hmm. you know, like, Draymond dealing with stuff. Mm -hmm. These guys with that clay, clay shouldn't have played. Well, well, his ankle is <laughs> But he doesn't have that in him to sit down and. I mean, the dude's yeah, ankle is. Yeah, what he did is un unbelievable. Yeah. The fact that he, he played these games after the game on the Everybody else would have There's not a single guy who would have played. No. He, he played for I can't tell you how much time he was He's super tough. Man. Probably one of the, probably the tough. I mean, he's iron, man. He's iron. He's, um, he's unbelievable. Great, man. We just want to win. That's what we're prepared for. We're prepared to win. We're prepared to control our destiny, our faith. Uh, most part, we're able to do that. Man. It's just, you guys just hung in there. All in there. This is a little bit different from last year. Oh, yeah. Last year, you spent a whole career getting that point. This year, the things you guys dealt with over the course of the yeah. year kind of got in the way every now and then. Yeah. But in the end, does that make it like the sweep kind of make it the right? Yeah, we, you know, uh, we came in this morning, uh, we talked to each other about we were here before last year. There was just, I mean, there was literally no no sound that you heard this morning. Mm. I mean, we were just, you know, guys were set on finishing this thing. I just thought we did a great job of hanging in, you know, um, and uh, just did a great job of being a group, and getting no egos, and allowing the talent to supersede all of them. <laughs> How big was Katie shutting them down last in game three? Well, he's, he's unbelievable, man. You know, gotta, maybe there'll be another guy like Kevin Durant some, at some point in the history of the game, but uh, yeah, he's unbelievable. Like, guy, dude plays himself into exhaustion. I mean, he just, you know, guy at that guy, he doesn't take plays off. Literally plays, and plays till he's exhausted. And uh, you know, when your top guys are doing that, you're really going to give yourself a chance to win. Some of the season. Some of the season, man. <laughs> 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 Love y'all, man.